Remember back a little while ago when the television per se or all those morning talk shows were pretending to be nutritionally uh, wise and scaring people to death about calcium, saying that calcium supplements in some way or the other cause coronary disease or heart disease? Well, thank goodness to actual science and researchers and data, the World Association, I should say, sorry, apologize, the World Congress on Osteoporosis and Osteoarthritis decided to clear up all of that confusion. What they did is they looked at studies or clinical studies done on this one event from 1966 to the midpoint of 2013. And what they looked at was 18 studies out of 661 that met the stringent conditions that were required to be actually considered a good clinical. And of these 18 studies, it added, or I should say, had 63,564 participants. Now, from this time, 1966, all the way to the mid-part of 2013, the researchers found absolutely zero connection with taking calcium supplements, increasing cardiovascular death, coronary death, or any mortality from heart disease whatsoever. So, this is something you're probably not going to hear on the morning TV shows or the morning news because the morning news doesn't like to attract things. So when it comes to calcium supplements, and oh, by the way, they say calcium with or without vitamin D did not increase coronary heart disease or any cause of mortality whatsoever in elderly women. With or without vitamin D, calcium, you name it. So when taking your calcium supplements, the science backs you. It's a healthy item, good for osteoporosis, good for building bones, good for a ton of other issues. So before you go listening to those morning talk shows, wait to see what the researchers and scientists say. It's actually a pretty good thing. And this one validated. Again, World Congress in Osteoporosis and Osteoarthritis showing everyone that basically calcium is a good thing. Thank you.